Hi friends, thank you so much for joining me again today. We're gonna to wrap up Earth Day by doing a fun art and sensory activity. Most of the materials you can probably find at home, I would just advise that all little parts and pieces um, be carefully supervised around the little ones. Let's get started. For the art portion of this activity, you'll just need a container or bowl to put water into. Clear would be better so you can see the colors mixing, a coffee filter, and blue and green food coloring. For the sensory portion of this activity, you'll just need some measuring cups and spoons and some loose rocks or stones that you might have or find outside. I have two little assistants to help me with today's activity. So Link is going to help by starting to pour in the water into our bin. And Lock is gonna add some of the sensory rocks. I'm gonna pour the whole thing in there. Good job. I'll take it. Now we're gonna add the food coloring. This is gonna be our earth tone colors. You Ask wanna do three? Put a little bit in. Good job. Good job. All right, Link, you add the blue. And we're gonna watch the colors swirl together and mix. This is a good science activity for the kiddos because they kind of see the color mixing that happens. Now we're gonna take our coffee filters and we're gonna put them inside of the water and see what happens. Can you go there? Can you go there? Can you hold that? Yeah. You wanna put it in the water? So let the colors kind of soak into the coffee filter. Good job. Let's pull it out and show how it looks. So you kind of get a blue-green swirly little coffee filter planet Earth for Earth Day. We'll put these up to dry. Pour some rocks in. I'm gonna pour some stones in the water. measuring cups and spoons and let them have at it. This activity is a good way for kids to learn about less and more, wet and dry, heavy and light. Overall, it's a good science, math, and sensory activity for the littles. Just make sure to watch out with the little pieces that kids under three are putting them in their mouth. I do it. Good job. Thank you so much for joining us. We hope you enjoyed this activity. Be sure to check in next week. Our theme is going to be the zoo. So we're going to be learning all about zoo animals and their environments. Thank you so much. We love you so much. Bye.